With From Software and Bandai Namco's Elden Ring set to dazzle the gaming world this coming February, we wanted to make sure it was going to be worth it. So we jumped into early access for the upcoming closed network test for Elden Ring and started our journey as a tarnish. Needless to say, we left knowing that things are going to be even more spectacular at launch. From the moment you kickstart the test, choosing your classes, and taking your first steps into the lands between, this is vintage From Software at its finest. But that formula has also evolved from what fans know and love. The world in Elden Ring is massive, with more verticality added for even more fun. There are crafting materials to harvest, secrets to find, and more enemies for you to test your metal against. The expanded scale is not just refreshing from the traditional design point of view, but also allows the developers to include certain events that can play out for shock and awe. Enter Flying Dragon Ague, with its red hot fire and large wingspan ready to deal the fatal blow. This epicness is never gonna get old, especially when combat comes into play in Elden Ring. The game maintains certain aspects that are mainstays for Souls-like, such as the dodge rolling, as well as the stamina system. Players can block, counter-attack, and break stances for more time to hurt their foes. You can even jump in the game to avoid attacks or unleash powerful jumping attacks. The addition of mounted combat is also a refreshing change that players will be able to experience in Elden Ring. With the spirit steed, large distances become more manageable. And in combat, especially with foes as large as a dragon, you can be darting in and out for surgical strikes and hightailing out of danger when the fire comes. On the other hand, we also have the more traditional dungeons to explore, where players can marvel at just how From Software are so great with all the little and big details. That fluidity and precision of the combat system, all the lore building that comes with the visual and audio designs. It comes to a point where every death is one to savor, as you begin to learn more about what you can and cannot do in Elden Ring. Add to that already intoxicating blend, even more monumental encounters with intricately designed bosses and enemies, and Elden Ring represents a non-stop rollercoaster ride designed to delight and horrify at the same time. Our battle against Margit the Fell Omen saw countless deaths, but victory brought a sense of satisfaction unlike any other gaming feat you can achieve. Considering that many other such encounters lie in wait for the full version of Elden Ring, it is absolutely amazing to know that the sense of satisfaction and desire to improve in a player will never be more keenly felt. It is clear as day that Elden Ring represents an evolution for both From Software and Hidetaki Miyazaki. Familiar systems have seen reworks, while new additions are meant to complement everything players love and more. If there was ever a Souls game to rule them all, Elden Ring is shaping up to be the prime contender for the crown.